Purse gainer again, third one of the night. <laughs> Doing a marathon, I think. <laughs> um, I'm going to do a Dutch fold card. I've never done one before. Um, and this one is so stinking cute. You can write your message up here um, and it opens out. You could put more designer series paper on the inside as well if you want. But how beautiful. Um, I'm using the Happy Birthday Gorgeous set for the flowers and the sentiments. Um, oh, I love this. Isn't that cute? And once open, the card will sit open on somebody's desk. So I'm going to set this to one side. You're going to need... Let me get my piece of paper. I'm using crumb cake as my base. This is, uh, I do apologise, I did the score line wrong, but because this is going to be a part of my main card, we can show that boo -boo. This is 4 by 9, by the way, and it's scored at, is it 3.5? Yeah, scored at 3.5, so it gives me a 2 inch border at the bottom, and that doesn't seem right either. That's better. Yes, it's, I put it down and scored at four and a half, but it's not, my darlings. It's, you could either score it at five and a half, or you can score this at three and a half, depending which end you want, because it's just going to flap over anyway. You're also going to need a piece in two inches by eight and a quarter, and you're going to score each end at two and one eighth. And this is going to wrap around the bottom of our card at the bottom to give us our little, um, what's it called, <laughs> what's it called, <laughs> um, our gatefold at the bottom. Oh, come on, Gainey, you got it right earlier. That's it. I'm going to manipulate those over and score those as well. So, they should meet in the middle now. Please don't do that. <laughs> I'm rushing to you. I've made... Uh... Oh, look, they over... they're overlapping there. I've done that. I've cut that a bit too long, I think. Let me just check. Why is it buckling? Let's try and manipulate it this way. I know it works one way. It. <laughs> I think I should just manoeuvre that myself. It worked earlier on, it was perfect. <laughs> you having a nightmare? As long as they fold together, that's fine. You're going to give your... I'm just going to trim that little bit, I think. It is in straight. Yeah, it's overlapping by a tiny fraction. So let me, I do apologise. I think you should do this at eight and an eighth. And just take a slither off. That's how much it was over. So I would cut that eight and an eighth. Oh, it worked the first time. <laughs> oh, well, we get it there. Right, is this going to be... Bang on now. Yay, it fits. <laughs> yes, it's uh, two by eight and an eighth. <laughs> and don't score it, just manipulate it around yourself. So I'm going to readjust that. I don't know why that, uh, that didn't work that time. <laughs> so this is our card. This score line doesn't want to stay. I've got that the wrong way round as well. Let me just try it this way. <laughs> yeah. Oh, watch it be too short. Why is my card like that? It's not sitting right. Perhaps I've done too many score lines on it. That's, see, it fits now. <laughs> Yes, if it's 
Yay, that's better. So, there's your, your base. <laughs> and you're going to need some layers now. I've used, again, um, mint macaron because I've got to the end of the month. Well, I'm going to use it, but for private. This one is five and a quarter by three and three quarters. This one is three and three quarters by three and a quarter. And you're going to need two of these. And these are both one and seven eighths by one and seven eighths. Your DSP then you are going to need, this is for the front, this is five by three and a half. You're going to need two little pieces and these are both one and three quarters by one and three quarters. Um, your whisper white then, that one's too big. <laughs> that one is three by three and a half. That's for your front where we're going to stamp our It's Your Day <clears throat> and the flowers. And this is art for the inside so you can write your message. And that one is <laughs> uh, sorry, I did, three and three quarters by three and a quarter. I will put all the measurements on my blog, I do promise. So I'm going to layer up these now. The ones with the designer series paper. Oh, I tell you what, I, I should stick to one or two and I'll not try and rush three. <laughs> but because I didn't do one yesterday, I'm going to spoil you tonight. So I'm going to make sure that is a nice quarter inch border all the way around. She's there, sticking to her fingers. What a beautiful paper. Uh, and this is from the Petals and Paisley design series paper. Um, absolutely stunning. I'm going to pop this in my card. Like I say, don't worry about that score line. Yours won't be there. I'm just using up the bits of card stuff to show you. So this is for video purposes only. <laughs> uh, I do donate to charity as well. And I'm sure they don't care what they get as long as they get something. And I'm going to add my whisper white piece as well. You can decorate this if you want to. I've just left it blank so I can so you, to show you you can write yourself a little message inside. You could even have put a layer of whisper white in there, leaving a good border for your pack of paper, but I think it's too nice. I'm gonna be adding something on there anyway, so let's get these little bits on. And all this paper is double-sided and is in the retirement list. So if you want to grab something now before the end of the month, because the end of the month is gone and you won't get it. So if you want something really badly, there's a lot of bundles retiring and you think, oh, they were going to be gone, they're going to be gone. But some of them are only retiring as a bundle. So you will be able to buy them in a the catalogue, but they'll be separate. They won't be classed as a bundle, so you won't save your 10%. Because there's so many other bundles coming out that you would uh, enjoy. So, um, I find this has got a little pattern. And I do try and keep it the right way. But yeah, the, some, don't be fooled because I rushed out and got something. And I encouraged all my lady friends to go and get them, my customers. And... It's in the new catalogue. It's just that it's retiring as a bundle, not as the actual set. You can buy the bundles, but they're going to be set, sold separately. So just glue that bit and line that up with your score lines and right at the bottom of the paper. Making sure, let's make sure they close first either side. Yay, perfect. Now look at that. Bang on. Yay. <laughs> so I'm going to attach these lovely little things as well onto my Dutch fold card. Not my idea, I must say. I cased this. Uh, there's so many about it. I couldn't give credit to anyone in particular because I've seen hundreds. So I'd be here all day trying to tell you who's a sword and who's a didn't and so, but you, yes, 
I have a look along across the internet, Pinterest, there's hundreds of uh, Dutch gold cards. They've probably been, been around as long as me. <laughs> How pretty is that? How pretty. So I'm going to add my... It's mainly attaching all your layers. We're going to get to some stamping in a moment. Which is the best bit. And takes the longest. <laughs> Beautiful. Right, now we can set this to one side. I am going to fetch in some scrap whisper white and some scrap um, mint macaron and punch one of those out because I'm going to need one for those for the centre. And I'm going to stamp my um, happy birthday in my uh, black. I'm loving this black tuxedo ink. It's fantastic. And I'm loving this birthday, uh, happy birthday, gorgeous as that's called. Oh, it's going to be in your new catalog and trust me, it's so darn cute. But I picked up on the colours, I used Rich Razzleberry, Stamped Off and then On and then Lighter. Um, Delightful Dijon, Stamped Off, On and Lighter and the same with the... Um, What's it called now? I haven't even got my inks ready yet. Okay, now. Cajun craze. Off. On. On. Gorgeous. So there's my stamp. Oh my god, it's beautiful. And while I'm out, I'm going to do It's My Day on here. Oh, I need to get it out. That's what I make a wish. <laughs> That's no good, is it? You could say make a wish. I've just done that on the last card, but uh, I'm going for It's Your Day. What a beautiful... Uh, what a beautiful sentiment. And I'm loving this font. It's, it's fantastic. Just all our stamp sets go together. Absolutely beautiful. I'm going to pop this in the centre. I should be using my piercing mat, but my paper underneath is really thick and cushiony, so... <gasps> Seeing I'm getting really good results, so... What to say? If it's not broke, don't fix it. <laughs> so I'm now going to punch this out. Oh, no, I'm not. Oof! I'm going to punch out my happy birthday. <clears throat> That's the punches out the way. The black ink is out the way. I'm going to add this. And get this out the way so we can concentrate on our lovely little flowers. And this is going on the inside of... I did add dimensionals but I think it's a bit too thick. So I'm just going to add this one flat. Um, so my card shuts properly. Get my bling on the go. And put one on each swirl. How oh, beautiful. Yes, yeah, the first time I've done a gateball card and I'm really pleased with it. Well, you know me and my fancy card. Eh? Fancy folds, I love them. Something different. I do love a standard card. And I love to decorate them. And, but I like to do all the fancy folds. To get all the good ones out of the way. I think they're all good anyway. So I'm going to add this flat. And I'm going to try and pop that. In the centre. Perfect. Like I say, this is for writing on. That's a better close. That's brilliant. So let's get uh, some stamping done. And like I say, I'm using Cajun Craze. Um, let me find it. Delightful Dijon. And Rich Razzleberry. 
lovely colours. And it's a bit dark on their own uh, as the full strength, so I'm using this lovely little flower. And I can pop these out of the way for a moment to be washed. Clean, should I say, washed. <laughs> oh God. Stick them on dip tap. <laughs> I'm going to pop that one in there. Make it, they've got little arrows on, so make sure your arrows are going the right way. That's pointing that way. That's pointing that way. It's also there, right? Um, look at this tiny dot of the leaf. I'm going to leave that on there because I'm going to do the leaf last. Again, this has got an arrow. I'm going to leave this one pointed up. It's just that I twist. It's my fault. There You'll see in a moment some lovely little grooves under here. And here is where the lighting is, the shadows. So, right, let's get my colour. I'll do one colour at a time. And I used Old Olive for the leaf. Again, stamped off before stamping on my card. So, let's get this going. And I'm going to slush it. Look, see, this is where I was doing it earlier. I only need to get rid of the excess, so just look how strong this is. Beautiful colour. And watch the lines, see? Those lines are like, um, and then that's the second, and that's the third. And if you do it lightly, like light, 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 you've got even more tones. Obviously, I didn't ink that properly, but uh, we're going to do that now. So I'm going to stamp off and on and off. Isn't that lovely? I'm only going to do one more in this colour. Oh, and now I'm going full strength. Did I go full strength? Yes, I did. I go full strength. Oh, great. I remember now which way this goes. Full strength on that one. Second generation on that. <gasps> Isn't that cute? And again, this is new. Anything with a flower just lately is just, oh, it's beautiful. It's floating my boat, as you say. <laughs> Seems a bit sticky. Let's get this back on. Get as much off as I can because I am going to be using another colour because they're all reds and pinks. And... Let's see if I can find myself. Let's fetch in another piece of paper. It's all scrap anyway, so it's just for stamping off on. Right, that's my rich raspberry. Oh, wait there now. No, I'm going to come back in with that one. I'm going to use um, Delightful Dijon. And again, this is a strong colour. That's one, two, three. See, I like the two. I think that looks quite... It's a dirty yellow to me. <laughs> that sounds awful. But no, I nearly did it then. Use my dirty yellow. One, two... One more, because I'm going to change the flower then. Oh no. Pretty. Right. I'm coming. I'm going to clean that up in a minute. Uh, my next colour is going to be my... Oh, why did I just put that away? I've got to do the, the buds. The actual flower imprint. This is what it's going to look like. Second, third. So it's got to line them up. No, I'm doing the full strength, aren't I? On the darker one. Oh, so pretty. Really pretty. Oh, sweet. Let's get rid of that colour now. We'll wash those after. Um, OK, 
Cajun craze and I'm swapping the flowers so I'm going to do some in the rich raspberry and some in the Cajun craze. Again this is uh, a really dark colour but beautiful. Again let me turn this round. That's first, second, third and even fourth. I like the second and third. So, and then, oops, I nearly did it again. First, second, third. Oh my god, that's lovely. First, second, third. I'm going to clean that up now. And in comes our other flower. This basically just lines up um, if the petals are in the right way. One, two. I don't know if any of you ladies in England have been watching Little Boy Blue, but I blast watched them all last night. Oh my god. Oh. And shivers to your bone. How arrogant some children can be and parents oh my god made me want to scream and shout at the tv <laughs> but how could anyone cover up oh i don't know stop it now again Ugh. again this is really dark the rich rather very so i'm just going to add a couple of light one i think that's enough yeah definitely i'm going to be washing them later because I'm going to come in with my leaf now. <gasps> perfect. Isn't that lovely? That's just, just perfect. So I'm going to... <laughs> I'll show my old olive gold. This is where my Cajun craze goes. <laughs> I've got a place for everything, so, and I've got OCD, and it doesn't go back the right way then. <gasps> Mama's tamping. <laughs> I'm old olive, right. Oh, now I've got another one. Don't, that goes down the bottom, that goes down there. I polish taps. That's, i got OCD really bad. Can't stand dishes in the sink. Can't stand dishes on the draining board. Oh, they got to be done, dusted and out the way. <laughs> Polish my taps, my light switches. <laughs> oh, see this again. Love, love old Ollie, but again, look, one, two, three. I think number two is perfect. And these fit, this little leaf fits in these little flowers perfectly. Big devil. Look how sweet that is. I just added some at random as well. Oh, sweet. And if you haven't watched Little Boy Blue, oh my god, get on catch up. Oh, absolutely brilliant. But also very disturbing in a way to think that parents could. Uh... Oh, you'll have to watch it. I'm not saying anymore. <gasps> Look at that. I'm just going to add some random leaves. I have. Oh, I've added a dark one. Oh, it's not that bad actually. Add some random ones. Oh, I like that now. Last one. There we go. And I stamp it is done. <laughs> Get my paper and my stamp. How pretty is that? So let's get this attached and then we're going to add some rhinestones as well. I'm sure, 
I think all should be on tonight, or maybe by the time one's finished downloading now, I think about early hours in the morning, but they'll all be on before you wake up. And if you're in America, they'll be on. They should be on before you go to bed. <laughs> Adding these to the little ones because there's a lot of detail on the roses. I think just the little ones need these. You can add more if you want to. Entirely up to you. Have I missed any? Ah, <gasps> no. Yay! That's three down. None to go. That's the one I. Oh, and I put them in the swirls. On. I'm not going to do that. I think it's a bit over the top. Well, you know, I'm going to do it. I'm a girl. There goes my uh, stamping dimensionals. <laughs> I'll pick up my best later. Just in those letters. Yay! So that's the one I did earlier. This is the one I've just done now. I had to look twice then. Pretty much the same. Oh, extra flower. Extra two flower. Actually, I only an extra one. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight on that one. One, two, three, four, five, six on that one. And one, two, three, four, five on that. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven on that. Quite even. So... If you enjoyed, a thumbs up, a share and a subscribe, that would be amazing. Not long now, ladies and gents. Let me check. Oh, two weeks and one day. So two weeks tomorrow. You can have your care loves. I can post them up the day before, I think I'm allowed for you to get them on the 1st of June. Oh, look at that. It's catching over there. But there we have it. It's my third card of the evening. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I've enjoyed doing them for you. I will be back on. I may only do one tomorrow because uh, it's not my night to stamp. But Abby's got pleurisy and a virus again, bless him. He's not too good, so I might be nursing my poorly husband tomorrow. So, I hope you enjoyed anyway. So, thanks for watching. You've all been amazing. And thank you all for subscribing. It's just amazing. Your support is, and uh, I'd love to thank each and every one of you I could in person. I'd love that, but I can't. Maybe one day. Take care now. I'll see you soon. Bye.